one. 22 CV 1042 1 ADB document 72 filed 11 slash 28 slash 22 page of 7. United States District Court for the District of Massachusetts. Jose Maria de Castro. A slash case slash a chill de Castro. A slash case slash a delete laws. Plaintiff and defendant in counterclaim. Case no. 1. 22 CV 1042 1 ADB V. Joshua Abrams a slash case slash accountability for all. K. Peter a slash K slash a Mashal Troll Mafia. Plaintiff and counterclaim. Affidavit of K. Peter I. K. Peter. Under oath deposed and state as follows based upon my personal knowledge. 1. I'm one of the defendants in the above captioned matter. I'm employed full time as a residential property manager and have been for six years. I live at home with my two children, age 16 and 13. I'm their full time caregiver and sole provider. In my spare time, I also run a YouTube channel. Presently called Mashal Troll Matthew. 2. The plaintiff in this matter, Jose Maria de Castro, Mr. De Castro, is a content creator that runs a YouTube channel called Delete Laws. 3. On October 29, 2022, Mr. De Castro posted a four hour YouTube video in which Case 1, 22 CV 1042 1 ADB document 72 filed 11 slash 28 slash 22 page of 7. Case. One, he explained the many ways in which he intended to go after a third-party witness in this, a small sampling of Mr. De Castro's outrageous comments directed at Mr. Lyon, some of which threaten physical violence, follows, he's going to go down. I'll send you his info. These people are so lucky that we're not in a third-world country. They don't get it. They don't understand. They were built for being a keyboard warrior. I was built for the actual war. H-E-T-P-S slash slash U-U. He slash N-C-P-V-P-V-F-K-K-I-8. T equals 3,763. Ha ha, liar. Let's see how you do when I publish the video on Monday. And then I just remind him that I'm gonna send. Uh, I'm gonna put a picture of his face out online. I sent him a clip of the video because I want him to understand that he needs to work with me. And not work with these disgusting troll mafias. I can make an example out of you. I'm going to track you down. HTTPS. Slash slash you. He slash NCPVPVFKKI8. T equals 8,868-2-27-48-2-3-2-0-4. You might want to think about your identity being leaked. You might want to think about how you can be creative and work with me is the only way or I'll just publish your identity and we'll figure out who you are. Pretty ball. H-E-T-P-S. Slash slash you. He slash N-C-P-V-P-V-F-K-K-I-8. T equals 9,102-31-41-2-3-2. Zero 05. This is going to get you fired. And I really don't want to. If this is going to get you fired, I really don't want to do this. I told him this over a month ago. A month ago. Just give me an affidavit and work with me. And I don't want to publish any of this. He has continued to bullshit me and showed up for court and with Kate and just wait. He's going to send me handpicked troll receipts here in a second. Wait till you see this. HTTPS. Slash slash you. He slash NCPVPVFKKI8. T equals 10,122-48-322-52-27 Emphasis Supply. Wake up, Ty. This is over. You don't have to be the collateral damage. And I only want her I.E. M.S. Peter and Josh Abrams, the co-defendant in this case. I just need the proof. I don't want to go with you. Not my fun. But that's the problem we have. You walk away from this. They go down from this text chain. H-E-T-P-S. Slash slash you. He slash NCPVPVFKKI8. T equals 11,073-4-303-5-2-4. On November 12, 2022, I published a live stream video entitled, Let's Celebrate. Ask me anything. In the thumbnail image for the video, a photograph of a man whom I now know his name Mark Adams was used without any context provided in the image. Video title. One for the background on the relationship between Messrs. Lyon and De Castro, MS. Peter respectfully refers the court to the affidavits Mr. Lyon filed in support of motions she previously filed with this court. See Ex 3741. Case 1, 22 CV 1042 1 ADB document 72 filed 11 slash 28 slash 22 page of 7. Video contents. Seeing as Mr. Adams has filed no appearance in this case, nor does he appear to be an attorney, and I had never had any contact with Mr. Adams whatsoever. At the time I published the video, I was not under the impression that he was a member of Mr. De Castro's legal team, 
I did not know that he was in any way affiliated with Mr. DeCastro. 5. My understanding at the time was simply that Mr. Adams had been entering group conference calls within my Discord server to take clandestine recordings, and I opted to give him a little nod as a joke through my video thumbnail. At no time in the November 12, 2022 video was Mr. Adams identified, docs, mentioned, or discussed. Again, because I did not know who he was, in fact, Mr. Adams' identity would have remained out of the public sphere, if not for Mr. The Castro's naming him in the motion for contempt, Ethno, 61, and identifying him as the individual in the photo, 6. On November 13, 2022, I published a live stream video entitled What to Do If You Get Doc's Chill as a Quarter of a Man. Although I will admit that this was perhaps a lapse in judgment given the pending litigation, in no time during my monologue in the video did I make any true threats or use fighting words against Mr. The Castro. My statements were not arbitrary nor unprovoked. On the contrary, they were a direct reaction to several days in a row of Mr. DeCastro repeatedly posting videos and social media posts on YouTube vowing to explicitly dox anyone who supports or views my content and lacing those statements with threats, including, but not limited to, vowing to obtain addresses of my supporters through the court process and sending people to their homes to harass them, vowing to obtain my supporters' employment information with the intent to contact employers and get them fired. Vowing to go after their families, children, brothers, sisters, mothers, friends. Yeah. Case 1, 22 CV 1042 1 ADB document 72 filed 11 slash 28 slash 22 page of 7. Threatening to send Colombians to my supporters' homes, which I inferred to mean the cartel or another South American criminal organization. Mr. DeCastro used the fact that he was traveling in Colombia at the time to add credence to his threat. 13 7. For these reasons, the November video was not an attack on Mr. DeCastro on his face. Instead, and in response to Mr. DeCastro's doxing threats, I provided instructions in the video on how to properly respond to the doxing if and when Mr. DeCastro was able to act on his express plan. In the course of this, I did express to my audience, albeit in a vulgar and confrontational fashion, that Mr. DeCastro's actions were carried out with the sole intent to intimidate and undermine and that overreacting to his constant attempts to gain leverage over me and the internet at large provides him, in my opinion, with an undeserved sense of power and control. Furthermore, during the stream's live broadcast, Mr. DeCastro was present in the comments section, antagonizing me further and continuing to issue threats to which I responded. 8. On November 13, 2022, Mr. DeCastro posted a public live stream YouTube video private. Two entitled Wanna Play Rough, I Like Rough, which he has now set to nine. In his November 13, 2022 video, Mr. DeCastro reiterates his desire to use this litigation to destroy me and my online presence. He specifically says, Kate, I'm taking you down, baby. I'm taking down your Discord account, and you know what? You're not gonna be able to pay me. Kate, I'm gonna get equitable relief. I'm gonna get you kicked off the internet. I swear to God, Kate Peter. I won't stop till I take you off the internet. Oh, she's, because she's a woman, because she's a woman. No, because she's, hey, just because she's a terrible person. Because she's a terrible person. 2359-2420, 2 13th Mr. DeCastro's November video was originally accessible via a link which is now private. HTTPS slash slash www YouTube com slash watch V equals TW3 H Liquid Veil. I have saved a backup copy of this video here, https slash slash www youtube com slash watch v equals uxr to mfw case 1 22 cv 1042 1 adb document 72 filed 11 slash 28 slash 22 page of 7 13th 10 in that same november video mr DeCastro openly threatens to dox and all harass third parties whom he believes have some connection to me in particular he states, among other things, you are in my head. I can't wait to dodge the next person tomorrow. And tomorrow is a big troll. Tomorrow is a big troll. Tomorrow we dox someone. We put their information out. I put them. I'm putting everything. Your parents don't get away. Your family doesn't get away. Nobody gets away. I dox everything about you. Your address, your job, your phone number. Everything. I put everything out there. I just don't put it on YouTube because, you know why. I don't want to get in trouble. 
but I'm putting all your information out there on the back channels. 39, 39, 49, and I'm gonna put a picture up of their house. I'm gonna put a picture up of their full, everything about them. I'm gonna dox them entirely. And by the way, I'm not just doxing here. I'm doxing you on the back channels, too. On every back channel I have. I'm sending your information off to everybody I have. You guys want to play. Let's play. I'm on vacation. I've got plenty of time right now. 49, 37, 49, 59, 11. The Discord server is an open forum with 2,800 users that is not under my direction nor my control. Outside of enforcing basic rules. 12. The posted rules in the Discord server are as follows. By being in this server, you are agreeing to the following rules. 1. Do not harass other users, brigading, repeated badgering, or prolonged personal attacks based on race, color, religious creed, national origin, ancestry, sex, gender identity, age, and dehumanizing attacks will not be tolerated. 2. No sharing of other users' private, personal information. This includes full name, birth date, address, phone number, workplace, family members, and identifiable photographs. If you self-disclose any information listed, you understand you are doing so at your own risk. This is a public, open server. 3. No slurs of any kind will be tolerated, i.e. N-word, f got word, etc. 4. If someone is bothering you, you have a block button and should use it before complaining to mods, i.e. Moderators. Case 1. 22 CV 1042 1 ADD document 72 filed 11 slash 28 slash 22 page of 7. 5. If you're under 18 years old, get the F out of here. You will be banned immediately. 6. No child pornography. You will be reported to Discord and the appropriate authorities and be lifetime banned immediately. 7. No gore. Photos or videos depicting animal abuse or death, child abuse, graphic violence, or death. Doing so will result in an immediate ban. 8. No photos of children. No discussing other people's children. It's F weird. First defense. Sent to the timeout room for 24 hours so you can sit and think about what you've done. Second offense. Sent to the timeout room for 24 hours so no one has to deal with you. Third offense. Banned for six months. Repeat bans will result in a permanent ban at the moderator's collective discretion. 13. Any speech contained within the Discord server that abides by the rules is allowed and unmoderated. I did not write any of the Discord comments that Mr. DeCastro has highlighted for the court. Nor did I direct any of my followers and slash or supporters to make those comments on my behalf or otherwise. None of the statements on the Discord server that Mr. DeCastro has highlighted for the court, again, none of which I had a part in, violated any of the aforementioned server rules. In particular, the brief discussion surrounding discussing law did not break any of the rules because discussing law is a public YouTube channel that is therefore open for public discussion. In addition, Making an off-color joke about being the bomb also did not break the rules. 14. Despite the court's order requiring that parties communicate through counsel, Mr. DeCastro has continued to reach out to me directly, apparently refusing to include my attorney on the communications. For example, in a November 20, 2022 email, Mr. DeCastro threatened me with litigation in multiple states unless I submit to his demands. I'm not including that email as an attachment to my affidavit out of an abundance of caution as Mr. DeCastro appears to have styled it as a settlement communication. Case 1. 22 CV 1042 1 ADD document 72 filed 11 slash 28 slash 22 page of 7. 